What were Doc Rivers' words? We have no toughness. I'm Kevin DuPont for Globe 10.0 here with Chad Finn. And Chad, we've got a 9-8 Celtics team. The coach calls them soft, or we have no toughness. Do you think that you think it's be, well? First of all, what do you think's behind his words? Are they the softies he's making them out to be? And what's behind it all? Yeah, it was interesting because it came the night against the Nets where they had the little rumble there. Yep. Uh, Rondo went after uh, Kim Kardashian's ex-husband, which <laughs> a lot of people probably have wanted to do. But Except for Kim. Yep. Yeah, exactly. But, uh, yeah, it is. I mean, they, they haven't rebounded. They've been uh, out-muscled by guys like Robin Lopez and Chris Humphreys and people like that. Uh, they do need to get a little bit tougher, and it had an impact on them. I mean, it didn't when they lost the other night. Uh, but it did the next game. You saw the Celtics team you wanted to see there, guys like Jeff Green, Courtney Lee stepping up with Rondo out. Uh, still a work in progress, but I, I think we all know where Doc was coming from. Yeah, and he exempted the big three, right? I mean, in, in terms of the discussion, he let yeah, those guys out. Yeah, Terry was in there with the, the two veteran guys. Here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And and then you see the Rondo response with getting in the in the in the scrum, if you will. But I do think it goes to what you just talked about. Doc identifying Terry, Bass, Green, Lee. Mm -hmm. And to me, that speaks more about trying to, a team trying to shape identity. Not necessarily being, certainly, he wasn't talking about fights anyway. But he's talking about determination. Go to the hole when you got to go. Rebound, which we know right. is a problem. It really does focus on those three, four guys, does it not? It does. You know, he, it's interesting because he almost spelled it out to, about the specific guys. Uh, yep. He said he said that night he was disappointed in the way Jeff Green was playing. Jeff Green's uh, had his moments after that, so maybe Doc got through to him a little bit. But he's kind of gone out of his way to praise Courtney Lee as a guy who's really trying to get it, trying too hard uh, to some extent. But I, I think Doc believes in Courtney Lee. It's maybe some of the other guys on that bench he's not sure about yet. All we know right now is the Celtics are 9-8, and eight, about six weeks into it. Got to be better. And you know what? Doc's a smart man. I think he's doing what he's got to do.